All right, well, I guess there was an amp-related thing that was going to happen today. You guys remember that uh, MT-15, the Paul Reed Smith amp? Um, what had happened was the customer was playing, then he started noticing uh, intermittent output. Um, uh, well, I noticed it too when I received it. Um, after a bit of a discovery session with this uh, little lunch boxer, um, it, I was able to ascertain that on the output PCB, the output transformer's primary, um, I think it was the blue wire, uh, had broken uh, its trace. It's broken its uh, solder connection, rather. Sorry about that. And essentially, uh, and, and intermittently, uh, the amp was being uh, played at stage volume in, into an intermittent load, which, which caused the failure of the output transformer. And then on top of that, um, there were two phase inverter caps that were improperly spec for 400 volts. I uh, replaced those with 630s. Um, and I'll say this. Just uh, here's the real meat and potatoes of this particular update that the factory, it looks like they've agreed uh, to take the thing back and to make it right with the customer. So that's where we are right now. Um, I've reassembled the amp. I'm, I'm leaving the power tubes out for its journey back home. It's gonna go back into its little uh, travel bag and uh, the customer will uh, pick her back up and send her on her way. And then I'm out of the loop unless they have some specific questions that they need answered or so. something else. I don't know. So a bit of a feel good ending. Uh, the guy's gonna get his, um, his amp back in working order. And that's about that. If there's any further updates, I'll let you guys know for certain. So um, those, uh, that quad of, Actually, wow, I have quite a few. I have about eight matched uh, two quartets or quads of EL uh, 84s coming in tomorrow evening. I'll be able to move that uh, Marshall 201 along uh, once I uh, do a little bit more testing with the new tubes in place. Um, and then the same thing with that, uh, what is it? Newcastle 30 amp over here, that Jackson Amp Works uh, little guy in a 17 inch chassis. So uh, that's it for now. I'll let you guys know if anything else changes between now and then, but I bid you a great rest of your day. Bye. Oh, hell, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna film the intro after the outro. Why not? This is a live recording. We're not gonna do a voiceover on this one. We're saying bye-bye to the little guy. Yeah, just make sure if you're going to use this case for its intended purpose, that it's just on your person throughout the transport process. Because I'll tell you right now, this thing, um, this thing is not going to want to be bumped around. There's no protection for the switches or the, or the knobs, potentiometers out front. Scary business. So this is going to wrap her up. Let me give you a little final parting shot there on the old uh, PRS. I wish you a, a safe flight both ways, little guy. You and en you enjoy your trip back home. Bye.